So this is uh, uh, The Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass is a DS game. Um, it's an older DS game. Um, came out 15 years ago uh, for the um, for the Nintendo DS in 2007, uh, which is really cool. It's like my first Zelda game I ever played, but the uh, I never finished it. Uh, I, I, I you know I played like a couple hours of it and I just put it down and never picked it back up again. So I'm playing this on my uh, Wii U um, as like the virtual console. Uh, so that's that's what we're doing. Uh, but let me tell you uh, the story so far. I know there's a um, uh, I know it's like less you know less than average pixels and everything. It is blown up, so you can see it's actually like kind of looks a little bit decent if you do this because that's how big the screen actually is um but let me let me tell you a uh, um uh what the story is so far so you can get um uh, caught up on it so this is uh phantom hourglass it's a sequel to uh wind waker uh where the entire world is flooded and at the end of wind waker we're like yep we're gonna keep it flooded godspeed so uh, we are on our way, uh, just traveling the world with Tetra when Tetra gets captured by the evil ghost ship. So it is our duty to find the ghost ship and rescue Tetra. We go across the world, we get the three spirits of power, wisdom, and courage, and we end up getting Tetra. And Tetra ends up being, you know, uh, Princess Zelda. We find the ghost ship, we find um, Tetra, and uh, unfortunately she's stone-ified. Like she's, she's covered in stone. Uh, we are informed um, that the old man was the Ocean King all along um, and uh, has been battling against this evil named Bellum who uh, is uh, um, sucking the life out of everything in the world. So it's our duty to stop Bellum. And the only way we can do that is by forging the Phantom Sword. The Phantom Sword is forged by finding the three medals across the world given to three different tribes. So we take a look at our uh, collections here, wherever it is, it is collection. <laughs> take a look at our collection. Um, and then the top screen right here, uh, you can, oh, okay. <laughs> the, 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 the top screen right there, you can see that we have one of the ores of the three there for the Phantom Sword. Oh, I think I could swap it, right? Ooh, there it is. Yeah. So you can see we have one of the ores right here, the Crimsonine. We need the Azarine and the Aquanine uh, in order to forge the Phantom Sword and then defeat Bellum. So um, we've already gotten one, and let's head back to uh, get another. You did it, kid. The pure metal is all ours. Now we're a step closer to the treasure. I mean, Tetra, yeah. Uh, what are you talking about? You haven't helped at all. Uh, you've got some nerve, you glittery bit of whatever. We're all making sacrifices. Maybe it's just that time... That gives us something to look forward to, doesn't it, Lineback? Uh, let's ship out and find the remaining pure metal. Right, yes. Let's come aboard. So, yeah. Um, I, does, does that make sense of the story so far of Phantom Hourglass? I hope it does. Okay, let's go over here. Uh, and get that uh, X marks the spot. All right, cool. So this is uh, our absolute travesty of a ship. Look how disgusting and weird it looks. It's, um, it's 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 an amalgamation of a bunch of uh, mistakes <laughs> that I have made with the design of said ship. Uh, but we're gonna we're gonna play this forward, see how it goes. Uh, if you're liking the stream so far, feel free to follow the stream. Um, I'll be live with Phantom Hourglass for as long as I want to. Um, and yeah, if you uh, if you stay for a bit, you'll probably end up picking up story beats, like what's going on. But essentially right now, what we're doing is we're traveling around the world to find the three different uh, metals in order for us to uh, forge the Phantom Sword uh, in order to beat Ganon. Or not Ganon, sorry, Bellum. Yeah, close enough, yeah. Uh, what was the enemy there? Oh, there's no... Oh... Oh, lordy. Really does remind me of Spear Tracks, though. Spear Tracks is the sequel to Phantom Hourglass. Oh, boy. Hey, what's up, Jolene? How's it going? How be? How do? I hope you're doing well. You know, I hope everything's fine. Treating you, treating you nicely. Okay, cool. Hello. Goodbye. This is Jolene. This is uh, Linebeck's uh, lover. But yeah, this is the prequel to Spear Tracks. Uh, which, if you guys like uh, Phantom Hourglass, I will be playing Spear Tracks afterwards. Uh, Lineback, show yourself. Ah, you again. Little boy in green. Any chance you might tell me where Lineback is? I didn't think so. Well, I suppose that means I'll have to deal with the two of you in order. 
And I will start with you. Prepare for punishment. This is the sequel to Wind Waker and also the prequel to um, uh, Spirit Tracks. Oh, you, you hit me. Whoopsies. Uh, but fantastic game so far. So I wouldn't let the graphics uh, fool you. Uh, this is a, a lot of fun. And it's, it's super cool, too. Um, I might be putting this on to the as uh, to YouTube as like a full like two hour video of like the entire game. Uh, we'll see how uh, uh, it goes in everything. I'm like how entertaining it is. And we gotta hit her one more time. Hello, goodbye. The graphics kind of are uh, over the charm, you know. Uh, about the charm. Uh, psh, not again. I have one last thing to say. I, I'm not feeling well today. Hear me. What a, what a beautiful, beautiful thing. Uh, phew, that girl will never give up, I swear. Listen, this belonging to a friend of mine. You can have it, Link. We're rich. We're rich. Hey, we're shipping out, Link. Let's put these waters behind us. Yeah, so if you've seen the, 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 the left over there, that was indeed... Um, that was indeed uh, the woman known as Tetra, who we found out in Wind Waker was Zelda. Uh because of her abnormal life force, uh, Bellum really wanted to uh, um, capture her. And that's what ended up happening. Where's the enemies over there? there. Alright, let's uh, let's do some salvaging here. Let's see what we find in the deep sea. How many pure metals do we have so far? We have one. We have one pure metal. Why is he Tetra again, though? Eh, she wanted to be, I guess. Who am I to judge? Okay, here we go. Fuck! I meant to do that. By the way, I meant to do that. That is that a hundred rupees? Let's go! Let's fucking go, dude! Let's go! Oh Jesus Christ! Dude, why is this one so difficult? I got, I got, I gotta focus on this. I gotta focus. There we go. All right, we got it. We got it. I got to focus here. I got to focus. Pause champ. Pause champ. Oh. I'm not going to get that ruby. I, I don't need to get all the rubies. It doesn't count for, like, anything. Plus, we already got the big one. So, that's, all, that's what we, like, really need. Like, the big hundo is, like, the, the good one. This is a really fun mini game, though. Ooh. We're fine. All the way up, and we missed it. Let's go, dude! Hell yeah! I'm also looking down because I'm literally looking at my console here. SD Phoenix, thanks for the Prime for two months. Welcome back to the Murder God on the stream. Thanks so much for the Prime. All right, what do we get from that? All of that work for a chain handrail? Okay. I think we already have like two of those. So, you know, I don't know about that. Let's do this. <laughs> uh, like that. <laughs> Four ugly parts. Yeah, we literally already have a chain hammer. Right you see it on our ship. We literally have one. It's on our ship right now. Oh my god. Rest in peace. That see what the hell is this? The What the? What is that in the distance? What is? What is this? Is this a Nintendo DS? What? What is? Look there, the island isn't marked on our charts, Link, and it looks like we can dock there. There, I've just added the aisle to your chart. Why not set a course for it? It's just a Nintendo DS. That's all it is. DS Island. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude, look at the look at the chart too. It's lit what? Oh my god! What is this thing? 
Uh, we can like dig here too. Oh my god, this is where the uh, this is where the the speakers were. That's so funny. That's so funny. Yeah, the doc was the stylus. What's down here? Goron game, 50 rupees per play? Yeah, sure, what is this? A special challenge called the Goron game will be opening here soon, but we are behind preparations. Oh, okay, so we, we can't go here yet. Exit on the upper right, prepare for your shovel. Yeah, whoa, whoa, whoa. All right, so there's a game here. We gotta progress the story a little bit more. What the hell? This is so cool. What happens if I go down here? Oh, oh, that that's what happens, hello. Oh, no, I have to have, uh, you. Uh, do this. Hello. Goodbye. Okay. Okay, nice. Got it. Nice! Oh, what'd we get for that? One, two, three, Mario Me. Thanks for the, uh, uh, one, two, three, Mario Me. Thanks for the 10 months. All right, we got a Courage Gem. Cool. For just defeating those guys. In the middle of the DS. What is this place, dude? DS Island? This is so funny. Hey, more bomb cheese, too. DS Island. How many gems do you have? I have a couple of them. I have five, nine, and five. So, um, yeah, I don't really know what the gems do right now, but we'll figure that out later. This is such a funny island, though. This is so cool. Okay, we'll probably have to come back here later uh, when we find out uh, when they open, because we need to progress the story a little bit more. Looks like. What's with this island? Sort of a different shape, don't you think? Nah, maybe it's just me. <laughs> All right, let's sit sail. All right, um, let's go around here. Actually, I don't know if I want to chat. Do we do the treasure? Do you guys want me to open the treasure chest? Like, do, do more salvaging? I do want to fish. Fishing in this game is so fun. Yeah, okay. Dun-dun-dun. Sharks. Okay. Oh, they are sh they're literally sharks. What the hell? All right, well, let's go fishing for them. That one pile of ash. Thanks for the prime for four months. All right, we got this. Watch this. I'm gonna pull up like the most rare fish you've ever seen in your entire life. Boss champ. Yo, David, and thanks for the, yeah, 26 months. Jesus. Okay. Oh, oh, this looks like a big fish. Oh my God, this looks like a big fish, dude. Dude, that thing is huge. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Oh boy. Oh, I got a Luvar. What is that? Five feet, eight inches? My God. Damn. That's like one inch shorter than I am. It's not very pretty, but it's very mild mannered. I regret relating this to me. Okay. <laughs> 
Alright, let's go do the salvage, and then we'll go to the next island. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Alright, so what's what's here? Ah, uh, dude, I'm hoping for something good. I'm hoping for something good. Oh, okay, that was easy. That's an easy one. Catch! Okay. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. That was close. That was a, that was a close one. Oh, oh, oh let's go. A golden chimney ship part. A golden chimney? Go to the shipyard to customize your ship. Oh, sick, dude. Oh, we gotta check that out later. Hey, what is, okay. What's, what's up with this? All right, let's check it out. Yeah, what's up? Wait, like, I can't go to that, that island. It's like, it's all, it's all covered in ice, it looks like, or, or something similar. Yeah, yo, oh, it is ice. Yeah, over there. Yeah, what the hell? There's, there's enemies right there. That's cool. Yeah, what is this? Hey, what's the deal with all this ice? We can't dock, Link. Yeah, look at this. I'm having one of my brilliant ideas. No, really, do you see it already? Turn a car around the icy ice. Isle. We'll obliterate it all with the cannon. Oh, oh boy. Okay, so we're just gonna. Um, yeah, we're just gonna. Maybe, maybe there's like this wall to protect them. I feel like we're the Titans, you know? <laughs> it, 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 correct me if I'm wrong. I feel like we're the Titans here, and we're trying to knock down these walls, and it's just like not a good look for us, you know? Okay. All right, we'll just knock him down with uh with our cannons here. Oh god. Oh god. There's so many enemies here. There's so many enemies. How do I hit you guys? I'm trying to hit you. It's not working. Okay, I got one heart left. <laughs> oh, is that really? Everything's fine, guys. Yeah. Keep an eye out for these enemies. Oh, I can just stop, right? Yeah, I forgot I can just start, like, stop around these guys. Right? And then go. Here we go. Okay. I'm glad we made multiple circles around this. Guys, okay, so far so good. Hey, 20 rupees off that one. Nice. And we should be almost done with uh, entering this island. Whoa, that's a cool island, dude. Hey, you know, yeah, I'm on the side of global warming, you know. Uh, you're welcome. <laughs> Let me, uh, let me help out a little bit, you know. Uh, I actually work for ExxonMobil. And there we go. Could be all the way down. And we have full access to the island. All right, we blasted all that ice and sent it sinking to the sea. I just want to make it clear that it was the fact that we hit it with our cannons and not the fact that our ship is literally a flaming mess 
All right. Maybe, maybe our just being near it because our ship is like a um, an inferno. Maybe that's what melted them. But you know, I wonder what kind of bizarre creatures are welcoming to wake, uh, waiting to welcome us. Will they lash out? Either way, let's go there, Link. Let's go. Let's go to the island. All right, let's go around. Isle of Frost is next. This is so cool. <laughs> welcome, you broke their walls. That's true. That is that is very true. I don't know if they're gonna welcome us. Maybe, maybe they're gonna just, you know, mark us because we just kind of destroyed them. Well, kid, I was wondering what it would be like walking on a big ice chunk, and now I know it's real frosty. Oh, look at them. What are these guys? They're like weird deer. A chew! As cool as it is, it warms my treasure seeking heart. Oh my lord. They're so cool. All right, let's go up this way. Hello! You guy, you came from out there outside the ice. Hey, what's your deal? I've never seen a nuki before. An anuki. You're gonna, stare at, you're gonna stare all day at us, or can you talk too? What, you wanna know where the pure metals are? How should I know? You gotta take a question like the, uh, you gotta take a question like that to the island chief. Me? No idea. Okay, so we gotta go to the island chief, uh, who will probably know where the uh, uh, metal is, the second one we need. The Isle of Frost. The island chief lives in a house on the hill to the northeast. Okay. Um, on the hill to the northeast. Okay, so that's, that's uh, over this way. Uh, but we'll, we'll see everybody else first. Ajax hey, Nova, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Thank you. Appreciate you using your Prime. Uh, the home of a somewhat smart Anuki. Uh, and then up here. <laughs> it's like, it's like, is that my house? What's going on? Nobody thought the trouble of between the Anuki and the Uke was a good thing. The Uke? Nobody thought the trouble between the Anuki and the Uke was a good thing. So we and Nuki and those hairy Yuke got together a hundred years ago and entered into a little peace agreement. Okay. Was it fair? Yeah, it was fair. Yeah. That doesn't sound very fair. You don't sound very convinced about being it fair. Like, oh, hey, like, does this food taste good? Yeah. It tastes good. Like, I feel, I feel like there's no certainty in that. Let's see what's up. The Yuke tribe that lives all over the ice fields are the crazed animals. Those beasts are so crazy. I don't even want to get into it. That crazy. Oh, okay. So there's still some animosity between the Uke and the uh, and uh, these guys. Interesting. What is this? The home of a more or less sensitive Anuki. Uh, hello? Uh, you guy, did you hear the big news? One of those hairy Uke has sneaked over here. Oh? Okay. I heard. You know? Hey, maybe you're the hairy Uke dressed up like one of us. You got me. Haha. <laughs> You're a uke. Uh, really? <laughs> you serious? Ah! Wow. All right. It's, are my looks that awful? Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Well, that's one way to kill someone, you know? Like, geez. I'll, I'll put on, put on like a hat or something like that. What? You look for the island chief's house? Yes. Should be right here, right? Here's an idea. Instead of asking me, go read the signs they got around here. Okay. That's like le that's like me to you guys. Hey, Poikro, when's Breath of the Wild multiplayer coming out? Read the signs. That's funny. What? How do we keep from freezing in a place like this? Come on, guy. Toughen up and pack a little blubber on you. <laughs> Achoo! <laughs> Sounds like the blubber is definitely working. What's over here? Oh, just a little fun stuff, okay. <laughs> All right, uh, then, so this should be the chief's house, right? The island chief's house. All right, so tell me where the metal is. What's going on, my guy? I love your beard. Is that a beard? Or is it, it's a giant mustache, it looks like. <laughs> you guy, I'm the island chief of the Anuki. You got a name, green guy? What'd you say? Linka, uh, so Link, Linkaboo. Linkaboo? Oh my lord. My tribe's been having trouble lately. I thought maybe you'd take care of it for us. Hold on. Wait, what? 
What, what's this you're saying? You, your name's actually Link? Yeah, you sure about that guy? What? All right, sure. It's whatever you say. <laughs> anyway, you want to know about the Azarine. Oh, okay, 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 okay. So we have the Crimsonine. We're going to be looking for the Azarine on this island. I scratch your fur, you scratch mine? Sure, all right. We'll help out in return for the Azarine. This might get a little long, so make yourself real comfortable. We and Nuki have got one enemy on this island. They're the Yuk. There was also a lot of bad blood between our ancestors. So a hundred years ago, we made an agreement. The Inuki live in the west, and those hairy Yuk live in the east on the Great Ice Field. That was the deal. But now some tricky Yuk have snuck over here. And he's taken one of my villagers. Now he's pretending to be with him. Now he's pretending to be him and living with us. All comfortable like. This is like a serial killer. Oh my god. And now we come to the part where I need something from you. Find the Yuk, who's impersonating a villager, and kick him out. Did you get all of that? I did. Don't say Among Us. Don't, don't. He's not an Okay, yeah, we're going to find the imposter. Oh, God. Oh, what? what? I, was Among Us a mistake on the world? It might have been. It might have been. Yeah, all right. Go to the Anuki Estates up north, Link. When you get there, you, you got to figure out which guy is actually the Yuk. Yuke are liars, every one of them. So this one will lie to you. So don't be gullible. Maybe if you find him, I might tell you where the Azarine is. Just saying. Okay. So we got to go uh, up to the north and find it. Hey, yeah, it's a weird feeling that he's not telling us the truth. But we're here for the pure metals. We gotta have to be careful. Let's go find the Yuke so we can get that pure metal link. Okay. Uh, Island Chief's house. We've already seen that. Okay. So hello. Uh, we and Nuki and the Yuke have been rivals for I don't know how long. I gotta be honest, I don't even know how it all started. Uh, I guess that the Azarine pure metal thing was once ours. But when we got in that big spot with the Yuke in the east and it got nabbed. That was like ages and ages ago. Grandpa used to rant all about it when we sat around the stew pot. Dude, I could get some stew right now. That sounds so good. Alright, so then hello. Uh, head north to the uh, Nuki Estates. A lot of schmancy houses over there. Uh, Ogami420, thanks for the two months of your prime. Uh, this this game is 15 years old, and I feel like a lot of people have either not heard of it or forgotten. I took a um, I took a poll on YouTube. Uh, if you want to take a look at it, a schmoozing over. I took a poll on YouTube uh, right here on The Legend of Zelda Phantom Hourglass. So 84,000 votes. So 84,000 people have voted in this. And 28% uh, of them have never heard of Phantom Hourglass, ever. They just never knew it existed. 23% um, uh, have played it. And 49% of people have heard of Phantom Hourglass, but have never played Phantom Hourglass. So, uh, 15 years ago. To answer your question. Uh, and Koala Club, thanks for the two months of your prime as well. Thank you. All right, so let's go to the Anuki Estates and f so we got okay, so we gotta go to the Anuki Estates over here, and we need to find out the person in the Anuki Estates that is a liar. Okay, we need to find the imposter. Oh God, I can't read it from here. Oh, whoopsies. Uh, Anuki Estates, and then I'm assuming you also say Anuki Estates. All right, so let's start with the bottom left here. Dobo's house. Okay, so this is Dobo. Hello. They call me Dobo. You're looking for the Yuke who's impersonating one of us, right? There's one easy way to tell it. The Yuke are all liars. And Mazo's honest. The guy never lies. Um, I just had to get that off my chest. So, Mazo tells the truth. Um, and then Dobo vouched for him. Okay. Malgum, thanks for the two months. Welcome back to the Murder God. You're in the stream. Oh my god, so many two month prime subs. Welcome back, guys. Appreciate that. Thanks for using your primes on me. Uh, yeah, yeah, the Temple of the Ocean King scared me. Uh, wait, wait. This is. Oopsies. Let's go over here. Uh, did, Eric ever sh did Eric ever show how his setup looks like? It's on Instagram, I think. Uh, Kumu's house. So this is Kumu. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm Kumu. Okay. Um, and yeah, the Yuke you're looking for is a liar. No doubt about it. I'd say either Mazo or Rue is li are lying to you. 
Uh, I thought you wanted to know. Okay, so, uh, Mazo, so, so, um, so, Ku says Mazo or Aru are lying. Okay. Hello. Um, I'm at Hin, uh, Hintobo. I hear things. I know people. I heard you're looking for the liar. I can give you a hint, but it's not going to come cheap. Oh, no. Uh, I don't want a hint. Okay. Uh, my name is Fofo. You heard that right. I'm sure you know this, but the Uke, they do nothing but lie. And Gumo never lies. Just saying. Okay, so, uh, so... Fomo says... What was it? It was y Yubu? What was his name? A uh, Gumo. Gumo. Never lies. All right, so he always tells the truth. Uh, so we'll go over here. Wait, are you... I want to double check that you're actually Fofo. All right, so you're actually Fofo. Okay, so you are... Mazo. Wait, what? Wait, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so Mazo tells the truth. And so either Aru or Mazo are lying. That we've seen from here. Okay. They call me Mazo. I don't care if you believe me, but me and Dobo only tell the truth. Just thought I'd say that. So, um, Mazo says that um, Mazo and Dobo tell the truth only okay i'm trying to jesus christ this is this is awful we got to work this out my name is aru okay so aru is possibly lying uh between you and me kumu is lying okay and i'll leave it at that okay so aru says kumu is lying okay Getting a little complicated. What a what a what a thing here. Okay. My name is Gumo. Okay, so this is a Gumo. Uh, either Fofo or Aru has been lying to you. So Gumo is uh, Fofo or Aru equals liars. Dabby. <laughs> Brazilla, thanks for the seven, uh, 27 months. Okay. Uh, okay. And this is Gumo's house. Okay. So we got to figure out the truth here. All right. So, um, Dobo said that Mazo is telling the truth. Um, and Kumu said that Mazo... And Aru, one of them are lying. Um, oh fuck, dude. I'm gonna I'm gonna scream. Okay. Um so Mazo so, so Duo says Mazo's telling the truth, but Kumu says Mazo's a liar. Or Aru's a liar. And Mazo says that Mazo and Dobo only tell the truth. So Mazo says that Dobo tells the truth. And so Do Dobo says that Mazo is also telling the truth. It is truthful. So Dobo and Mazo are clear. Because you can't have two. Um, so they each vouch for each other, right? So it's not Dobo and it's not Mazo. So we get Gumo saying that Fofo or Aru are liars. Um, and you get um, Kumo saying uh, that Kazo and Aru are liars. Oh, Mazo and Lu. And Mazo is telling the truth. So that means that, um, I think Aru is the liar, right? Because Gumo says that Fofo and Aru are liars. And, um, Aru says that Fofo is a liar. So if Aru is a liar, then Fofo is actually telling the truth. Because Fofo says that Gumo is telling the truth. And Gumo is telling the truth that either Fofo or uh, Aru are liars. So then Aru has to be the liar because Dobo and Mazo um, both vouched for each other. So I think Aru is uh, the imposter. That was actually like a lot more easy than I thought it would be. It seems like really, di like it seems uh, like extremely complicated. 
So I think I think I got it. I think I got it. Yuger liars. One of them's lying to you. Ask them to ask some more. Hit them with the tough questions. One that you find the imposter and supposed to yuke for who they are. Oh, do we have to go? I think we have to go back to talk to Aru. I think it is. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, Kumu's house. Where's Aru? Uh, is this Aru? Aru, okay. I don't know what happens if we get it wrong, but I think we got it right. Hey, guy, what are you doing looking at me like that? You're telling me I'm the suspect? You're saying I'm a yuke in disguise? I think it's you. Final answer. Get back! I say stay back! I'm innocent! You come at me, I swear I'll have to protect myself. Don't come any closer. Think about what you're doing. Don't be stupid. All you have to do is say you made a mistake. Book him, dude! That's him! Hey! How'd you figure it out? I thought I had an amazing costume. Let's go. Dude, let's go. Oh my god. You're a yuke? You look so innocent. You look just like a roo. Don't do anything stupid and try to fight. Turn yourself in. Be quiet. If you yell anymore with that squeaky voice, it drives me wild. Eek! Oh god, it's a monster. I'm gonna eat you. No, I'm not tasty. I taste awful. Eek! I'm yellow, but I don't taste anything like a delicious fruit. Whoa. Yeah, of course not. You know, <laughs> well, I could try and make a run for it, but I guess I might as well give in now that I've been caught. As a show of good face, I'll show you something good. Wait right here. Don't move. Uh, oof. What happened? That was crazy, wasn't it, Link? We went all in trouble finding the Yuke, but he blew us away. Well, if we don't do anything, he'll just get away. It's not fair. Let's go talk to the island chief and tell him what happened. Well, he got away. I thought I thought he had something for us. But I guess I guess all Yuke are liars, you know? Dude, all right. Let me go over how I figured it. All right. I, I'll go over how I figured it out again. Because uh, I thought that was, like, really cool. Um, it's, like, super, it's, like, super easy. With, you can only, you only need, like, three of them to figure it out, right? Because Mazo, so, so, Dobo says Mazo's telling the truth, right? And if we assume that that's true, then Mazo's saying Mazo and Dobo only tell the truth. Like, those are the only people that tell the truth, right? So you have Mazo telling the truth, vouching for himself, but Mazo also vouches for Dobo. Because Dobo vouches for Mazo as well, right? You get two people vouching for each other. So one of them is, like, like one of them saying, like, oh, hey, Dobo's telling the truth. The other one's saying Mazo's telling the truth, right? And so you get both of them vouching for each other, which means one of them can't be it. So then uh, you get uh, Kuba, uh, Kumu saying Mazo or Aru are lying. And since we already know that Mazo is telling the truth, Aru has to be the liar. And you can double check it with uh, Aru, um, Gumu, uh, Gumo, and uh, uh, Fufo. So yeah, it, that's, that's how I uh, went about it. Oh, that's a really cool... That's a, that's a really cool puzzle. So, like, you guessed? No, I knew. You passed the SAT? No, <laughs> no I, got a, I got a 34 on my ACT, though. That was fun. I love logic puzzles like that. Uh, the Strang, thanks for the three months. Thank you. Super Somber, thanks for the 20 months. Oh, my God. And Brazilla, thanks for the 27 months. You make me want to play this game again. I hope you're enjoying it. I am. I really am. Explain in Fortnite terms. All right. So, uh, Jody or whatever, you know, Peely says he drops in Loot Lake, right? But then then jo Jody or whatever his name is, right, says that he's going to Tilt the Towers. However, when he says I'm going to Tilt the Towers, he actually means that I'm going to Tilt the Towers or... I'm going to Loot Lake. And since he says that Tilt the Towers or Loot Lake are actually the places that he's going, right? And then somebody else says, oh, no, I think Jordy's actually going towards, um, um, uh, fucking, what's another place? <laughs> um, uh, uh, Tomato Town, right? Um, uh, he's saying, like, oh, I'm either going to Tomato Town or Loot Lake. It's like, okay, well, if you're going to Tomato Town, it's like clearly you're not going to Loot Lake or Tilted Towers and you have to be the liar. I definitely crossed my, my strings there. That was not right, but that's what it was, you know? All right, let's talk to the chief, see what he says. 
Hey, guy, I heard the story, Link. What, already? Yeah, I did it. You scared that uke right out of the village. Now the people can rest easy and sip on their savory stew in peace. But uh, I don't feel a little mad about getting blown away like that. <laughs> don't you want to get revenge on these uke? I mean, sure. Mm, yeah, of course, we want to get the revenge. Yeah, of course, nobody can resist a little revenge. We're going to open up the cave to the great ice field to the east. The uke are over there. Go get yourself all the revenge you can. That Azurine you're looking for should be in the Temple of Ice. Okay. Let's go do it. Onion Man, thanks for the four months. Welcome to the Murder God in the stream. And hey, thanks for the follows too, guys. I appreciate it. You know, I, I'm, I'm, I'm happy that you guys are enjoying the stream as much as I am. Um, Phantom Hourglass is a game close to my heart. I have never finished it before, but yeah. Uh, you guy, jump on top of the peg uh, thing right there. It's fine. What, you hate pegs? Yeah, I'm not really into those. Uh, they do something to you? Go on, give it a try. <laughs> okay. JD, thanks for the Prime Gaming. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. It was so cool seeing you guys uh, at the uh, Mogul, Mogul Money and also uh, the Cup Long Tournament. It was, you guys were so nice. Uh, I don't know if I have anybody uh, in, uh, in chat that were there or that I met. Um, during the time, but yeah, if I did, um, it was an absolute pleasure. It was so cool meeting some of you guys, and like everyone was super respectful of like, hey, you know, I'm gonna go up, take a picture, say hi, like, hey, I like your stuff. Here's my favorite video, and I was like, hey, it's a small conversation. And then, you know, once I was over, it went away for for somebody else to do it. Like it was it was so cool because it wasn't like like nobody like everyone was like respectful of each other's times. Does that make sense? Like, so someone would come up, take a picture, and they're like, oh, hey, cool. All right, now I'm going to go so then somebody else can, like, take in, uh, like, another picture. And, like, it was, I was, like, really neat. Uh, it was, like, so cool, like, seeing a bunch of people. Uh, and they're like, oh, hey, like, I've, I've been watching you since, like, you were at, like, 10,000 subs. Or, like, I remember when you were doing this or, like, this era of Point Crow. I'm like, yo, oh, that's so cool. Um, and it was, it was funny because, um, dude, I got to tell you about this. I, I, I forget who the guy is. Um, I, I, I forgot their name, but I remember what they were wearing. They were wearing red and, uh, they come up to us cause we were on the floor in, uh, mogul money. We're on the floor. Uh, and, um, it was like me stands a truck and, uh, Jarvis, uh, and we were all chilling together. And, uh, I think, uh, a truck got, no, and then like stands got pulled away, um, from another, um, for, to take a picture with, uh, with somebody. And so it was me. It was, it was Atrock, Jarvis, and me. And we were just all talking in a row. And uh, there was this guy that came up to us. And it was so funny because he's like, hey, can I get a picture with uh, just you two? Um, <laughs> and we started laughing because it was like, it was me and Atrock. And he's like, yeah, no, I don't, you know, just, just, can I get a picture with just you and Atrock? Um, and we're like, that's, it was so funny because Jarvis is objectively like the biggest, you know, person like with audience there. So we're like expecting it, you know? Um, and those are we're laughing. It's like, I, and then he explains it. Like, no, 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 no. Like, like, I don't mean it like in a rude way. I just only watch like Atrock and Point Crow and I have no idea who you are. <laughs> and it's so funny because that was, it was, <laughs> that was happening like all night too. Like it was, it wasn't like just a one-off thing. It was like, I'd be talking with Jarvis and then someone would be like, oh, hey, Point Crow, can I have a you know, picture? Or like, he's talking with like, hey, Truck, he's like, oh, hey, Truck, can I have a picture? <laughs> and so it all culminated with that one guy of like, can I get a picture with Atrock and Point Crow? Just, the, I don't, I'm sorry, I don't know who you are. <laughs> it was so, it has to be one of my favorite interactions with anybody because I thought it was hilarious. And I mean, hey, the, the guy, you know, know didn't know Jarvis, so it's totally fair. I just thought it was so funny. Um, <laughs> yeah, the other guy. Can you hold the camera? <laughs> oh, my God. Who's Jarvis? There you go. That's the guy. <laughs> the Great Ice Field. All right, this is where we're supposed to go. Um, but I thought it was just a funny interaction. There's another guy. Sorry, there's a guy at um, the Cup Pong Tournament that I... Uh, um, um, that, that, um, I, I went into the crowd a little bit and, um, I, I ended up signing a bunch of things, which was so cool. Um, I, I was like, me, I'm just a guy, you know, why do you want my signature? Um, but there was a guy who, uh, it was like, Hey, can you sign this? And he pulls out, uh, something that he's holding and it's a VHS box of ice age, like a case for the VHS tape of ice age. And he says, can you sign this inside? Isn't 
Ice Age. It's actually a copy of Charlotte's Web. And I was like, what? And the thing, it had, it had a lot of signatures on it too. <laughs> so it was a box, it was a VHS box of Ice Age with a tape of Charlotte's Web. I was like, you know what? I am, I am honored to sign this for you. I thought that was so funny. Yeah, that's a cool autograph book. There's a whole pack of nasty uke roaming around the great ice field. What? How are they nasty? Oh, guy, you do not want to know. Chat, it's funny. You guy, I got a word from the island chief about you. Uh, you want to head through here or what? Yes, I do. Let's go to the great ice field. The living in your head rent free. Hey, Sam got um Sam got recognized. Sam Witch. Um uh in the bathroom. That was that was actually kind of funny too, because I never had like an event where we were like scared of being swarmed. Um uh so like everyone was really respectful because I had to I went to the bathroom, right? But like, you know, with, with everybody else, you know, so it's like I get I kept getting like some looks of like I'm like in the urinal and there's like, like people like, like <laughs> but nobody came up to me, thank God, in the bathroom. Please do not do that. Um, but it was, like, really funny. Because then afterwards, like, I went out and they're like, hey, can I get a picture, you know? Um, but it was like, um... <laughs> but, like, you could tell, like, there was, like... You, know, like, you, you felt eyes on you. And I was like, that's crazy. Uh, G Cheesy Wheels, thanks for the two months of Prime. Oh, God. Speaking of Jarvis, are you ever going to collide with him? Yo, hell yeah, I love that man. He's so funny. All right, let's go to the Great Ice Field. Sorry, I just want to pause for some stories. All right, Great Ice Field here. Um, this is the cave on, on the way here. Okay. Uh, we're going to the Ice Temple to get the Azerine. Do not erase. The Yuke's weakness is really simple. Yuke, breathe deeply. Inhale, mouth, a throw. Most, uh, most of the message is wiped off. Okay, so I'm assuming to defeat the Yuke, we use bombs. And then when they inhale, uh, we throw a bomb at them. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, hello. So this is the Uke. Are they actually like bad guys? Yep, they seem like bad. Oh. Damn, you take a lot of hits. Jesus. All right, murder. Murder. Oh my God. Would you ever cosplay anyone? I probably wouldn't. No, it's not a thing I, I, I do. They're killing sentient people. But what if they deserved it, you know? <laughs> Genocidal maniac? Stop! I'm not... They, they had it coming, all right? They're not attacking me. Wait, is it is it fucked up that they're not attacking me? <laughs> yeah, Chad, it was self-defense. Where? <laughs> Hello, Yuke. There we go. Oh, okay. So we had to. Okay, chat. We had to defeat all of them. All right. It wasn't me just, you know, killing the entire colony of Yuke. The game wanted me to do it. <laughs> I had nothing to do with this. It was the game that, that made me do it. Hello. Okay. The Temple of Ice, glorious home to the pure metal, stands ahead. To open the path, the six guardians of the great ice field must be defeated. Whoops. We already did that. Oh. Hello. Oh, it's the, it's the imposter Yuke. Hello. Oh, 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 shoot. You actually attacked me. Okay, nice. Hey, we got him. Let's go. Easy. Yeah, he vented. I saw it, guys. Oh, this is the ice temple. Here we go. The temple of ice. For the second 
pure metal. So this must be the Temple of Ice. There's a blizzard howling outside, but it's actually pretty warm inside. At least we'll get out of the cold in here, yeah, Link? Okay. What is... Can I, can I like, attack this? No. All right, so what is this? All right, let's go through this. So in case you're curious about, like, how we do temples and everything, I just kind of do it, you know? I just kind of go for it. It's kind of like, you know, whatever. Um, I hope you guys enjoy because I fucking love temples here we go easy so far oh, we're going it looks like we're going to be using a lot of bombs in this uh um in this temple okay so we have here just go past it easy um is there a way we can get uh away there is okay so now what I want to do is stay on this. Ooh, actually, how do we do this? Um, because I want to do this, but I can't go away. Um, unless I like, I could like bomb chew it maybe. We'll have to see. Link's not allowed in airports. Yeah, it seems like that. Honestly, how should we do this? Um, can I go? Oopsies. Wait, let's ignore it. Let's ignore that. Okay, ignore that that happened. Um, I can, I think I bomb chew this. Yeah, I think I, I think I have to bomb chew it. So I go in the middle here. Like that. Oopsies, I fell off. Oopsies, I fell off. Wait, did, did the bomb chew not work because I'm stupid? understand all right I, I i i get it i understand it's funny all right there it is there okay awesome that's what we wanted to see now we can go inside good to know good to know good to see good to have good stream oh okay oh god oh no dude we have ice puzzles no, not ice walking. Dude, oh, really? Really? Like this? All right, I can step on here. Can I shoot like this from here? I can. Nice. Yeah, they told us that uh they told us that we can do that in the uh in the village. Uh I'm glad that that weird small tutor tutorial actually helped me. <laughs> Actually, uh, you know, came back. That was cool. What are you? You're, you, that's a weird enemy. Okay. Uh, what's in here? Yo, 100 rupees. Sunflower Salt, thanks for the eight months. Welcome back to the murder. Glad you are enjoying the stream. All right, so there's an order that we probably have to pull these in. So I'm not going to pull them yet. Um, and we're going to kind of explore down here, see what's up. Do you hear why there's a timer? The timer's just like uh, the um, amount of time it's taking me to go through all of this for the playthrough. So it's not like a speedrun or anything. It's just like, I've been playing. Uh, it's 13 hours into this playthrough of the game. Um, cool. All right, so we're back here. Okay, so is there is there a pattern that we need to discern for this is my question. There is a thing up here that might tell us a pattern. So if we get over there, um, how do we get up here? Uh, from down there and then through this, um, through this. So we need to find a way how to get through that. Um, there's a gap over here. We can just jump. So you're gonna tell us, you're gonna tell me something. Pull the four levers to open your way. Draw a line due north. Pull the lever in that location last. Okay, so uh, we have to pull all four. So uh, if we do a uh, line due north, so this one is uh, last. So this is number four. Uh, whichever one we have right here, this is number four of the uh, three that we have, um, which is happens to be this one. Okay, so this is number four. Um, I'm assuming 
uh, that there's another area that we have to do something similar with. So down over here, it seems like we have like another gap that we can cross. Yep. And so you say, pull the four levers to open your way. First, pull the lever on the far left. Okay, so we have the far left one. Uh, we actually guessed this one. So this is number one. So it's either two, three. All right, we actually don't need to complete the other ones. We can just kind of guess. Weefy Anna, thanks for the three months. Because there's, there's only two um, options we have. Because we have one, we have a, um, uh, so we have this one. So it's one. That's four. So this is probably two. And this one's three, right? Most likely. Um, and then this one is the four. All right, so it's the other one. So we have two options. So this is one. And then two is all the way over here. This has to be three. And then this is a confirmed number four. Easy. And that is how you do the puzzle uh, with, like, little knowledge. Cool. Let me kill you real quick. Um, awesome. So there's this. Is this a... This is a path alongside here. Whoa! Oh, God. That's so annoying. Oh, no. I'm ice keys, dude. Ice keys? Really? Liber B, thanks for the uh, tier one. Thank you. Well, as you play this game, have you enjoyed the... How have you enjoyed the Ocean Temple? It's fun. I like it. Uh, I, I feel like I didn't like it so much when I was younger, but I like it a lot more now that I'm older because I think I can, like, figure it out, you know? Okay, so what do you do here? I have no idea what you did, but... Oh. Okay, so that's a timer. So we need to hit these at the same time, it looks like. Okay, and then I'll do you. All right, so I need to hit you at the same time, which means I probably use a... Oops, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> uh, which means I probably use a bomb chief for this. Fucked. That I fucked up. I hit both at the same time and it did nothing. Okay. Um, okay. Then down here. Uh, whoopsies. <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. I meant to do this. So down here. Uh, okay. Whoa, what is that? Okay. Oh, down here we can just do this. We can we can throw the bomb here. I'm wondering what these are. Because there's, there's, there's a couple different um, uh, orbs that we need to hit, but we have not yet. I am missing. There we go. Yeah, because we also have this. How the fuck do we hit all of these at the same time? There's three of them. Do I just bomb chew all of them? I can't. I literally can't. Um. Hmm. We have a problem here. Very interesting problem. Wonder, can we do it with a boomerang? I need to be over here. Yeah, I need a place between all three of them. Because I can't reach it from there. I need to be over here. And now that we've... Okay, now that we've done this, we've swapped it to blue. We can actually stand right here. That's what that's for. And hit all three of them. Oh, is there a fourth too? Oh, there was. Okay. <laughs> There it is! Awesome! And because of that, we got a key, which we can grab with the boomerang. Solve the puzzle! Okay, awesome. Touch the door and open it. You can only use it once. Cool. And I'm assuming you're about to, yeah, 
follow the numbers below. Two, one, uh, one, two, three, four. Oh. Wait. Wait, did I accidentally do them in order too? Wait, what? Oh my god, wait, 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 what? What? How did I, wait, how did I do? How did that happen? I don't- I don't think we do that in order. It was not the order I did- I guess you just- if you just hit them with the boomerang? Because- okay, maybe- okay, here's what I think. Maybe it expects you to do it with, like, like, an arrow. And do the arrow in order. But I just did it with a boomerang, which you don't even need to do. Or maybe the order only activates when you read the stone? That's so wild. I can't believe we got that. That's hilarious. Okay, well, you know, I, I'm just, you know, breaking this game one step at a time. Let's go in. Oh, actually, before we go in, um, yeah, before we go in, there is a uh, treasure chest I do want to open. Uh, I saw it over this way, um, and uh, it might be good. Yeah, it's this thing over here. Ooh, a wisdom gem. All right, sick. Awesome. Spicy nematode. Thanks for the 14 months of Prime. I feel like I'm the only person who loves this game still. Hey, chat, put a one in chat if you uh, love this game. You're not alone, spicy nematodes. You got chat. There we go. Let's go back up here and uh, through that door. One puzzle at a time. This is going so well so far. It's going really well. Hi, Jonic. Thanks for the Prime Gaming. Thanks for using your Prime and first sub on the channel. Uh, welcome in. I'm glad you're enjoying Cool. Okay. So we have a boss battle. Mini boss? Ah, with another uke. Of course it is. With two ukes, actually. I lied. Um, a little bit harder, but that's fine. Oh, I thought I would be able to hit. That was weird. It was, it was a little out of my range. both of them all right that was that was good that was a good battle sick awesome all right so what do we get for defeating uh those ukes new item a grappling hook tap things to grab onto them light objects will be pulled towards you you'll be pulled to heavy objects okay okay wait well, we can try it okay so with the the grappling hook new thing so is oh that's what these are for right Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's so cool. Can I grapple back? Okay, so you can also grapple onto uh, torches. Good enough. Good enough. Good enough. Cool. That's that's pretty sick. Okay, so we're probably going to use it here. I think I can use it to beat you. Oh, okay. So you can pull their heads away. Interesting. Okay, awesome. So what about you? Can I... Oh, you can hit people with the grappling hook. Oh, okay. So it's like a long distance kind of thing. What are these things? Tongues? So I have to pull this one to make sure they're all three. Okay. Interesting. Interesting mechanic. Okay, so once they're already pulled, you can't, you can't like unpull them with the grappling hook. Nice. Okay. Sick, dude. Reminds me of when you played Death Store. Dude, great game. Actually, amazing game. Love Death Store, dude. Fantastic. Oh, and that's... Okay, that's our uh, thing to go back now. Okay, cool. Um, all right. So, we have it unlocked over here. Um, maybe... Ah, so what if I do this? Oh. Oh, you can only do once at a time. Oh, maybe you have to be, I have to be in front of that for, to pull it. Okay. That makes sense. Now that I have both, it unlocks it. Cool. Kirchenko Twist, thanks for the five, uh, five months. Loving Phantom Hourglass. Just finished your Celeste VODs too. Ah, I hope you enjoyed Celeste. That was a lot of fun. Um, and Phantom Hourglass is cool too. Thanks for the Prime. Thanks for using your Primes, guys. We had so many Primes. So many Prime subs. So many Prime peeps. Um, okay. Uh, B1. Uh, let's... 
do this because this is pretty obvious. And then up here. And then I can do this. Ah, cool, cool, cool. Um, can I also uh, do this through? Not do it through the melting. Okay. But I can. Oh, right, you can grip onto a treasure chest. Oh. Okay, okay, okay. I'll open the treasure chest in a second. But now we go. Oh, it's just, it's just a thing. Okay. Now I open this. Two hundo rupees. Ooh, let's go. Um, okay, and then I'm assuming we blow this up because there's a uh, space right here. Seems like it. We rich, dude. We rich. Um, all right, so uh, you're about to probably say something about like, boing -oing, you stand before the great and ominous tightrope challenge. Do you fully comprehend? Yes. Life is a tightrope rock. No one knows what will happen when you're in the middle of it. Uh, the type rope challenge. Um, oopsies. So let me actually do this first. Let me. What does this do? Okay, right, turns off. Okay, interesting. You're my favorite streamer. You're my favorite viewer. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, I didn't mean to jump off after that. So I can just like do this. Oh no. What? You? Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay. That's pretty cool. So if I do this, I can create another tightrope. Oh, I have to be in, in view of it. That's that's a cool mechanic. That's a really cool mechanic. So what about here? So I can stand. Oh, I can stand here, and then uh, I think this is a uh, bombable spot, right? Never seen this mechanic before. Yeah, right. It's super cool. Um, can I shoot from here? Like over? Not nah, okay. Um, so we need to find. I need to figure out a way. Oh, to do both of these. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I have to hit all four. And the only way I hit all four, it seems to be like it's in the middle of this. And this tight stop. I swear to God, I, I'm going to scream. Oh, my God. L plus ratio plus fell off. There we go. So if I go in the middle and then I use... Oh, that's cool. That's really cool. You have to use like two key items in conjunction and then a third to hit the eye. What even is that? Dude, dude, how big brained that dude, that's, that's a crazy thing. That's such a cool puzzle. All right, then you pull that. Uh, reveals that later. Okay, I can't, oh. Why is that timed? Wait, if that's timed, how the hell are we supposed to get there? Wait, what? Wait, how the hell are you supposed to... What the hell? How are you supposed to do that? Okay, that's 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 weird to me. That seems like a really tight timer. Um, I'll figure this out. I'll figure this out. Let's go the other way. Let's see what's up over this way uh, in the temple. And if it's good, then we'll be good. If it's bad, we'll be kind of stuck a little bit here. That's all. That's that's all fine. Um, I pulled this. Ah, smart. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Can pull that. <laughs> okay, let's go up here. You can still hit them from behind like that. Another. Okay, so now we can go back and deal with that. Oh, but that's... Hmm. 
lot of timers here. <laughs> Dude, we pulled that. Oh! Oh! Wait, 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 wait. That's a super long timer now. Because we pulled it so far away. Oh! Oh, I get it. Okay, okay, okay. A small key. Now we, now we're good. Now we're like we're fine. Like you hear that? You hear the timer? It's still not out yet. That's such a cool mechanic. It's like you, like this. This is such a cool game because the the things that you you see like keep building on top of each other like one after another like they keep like you're like okay you have a tightrope right and now you have the eyes and you use the tightrope with the eyes and then it's like okay so now how can we like take this this grappling hook and do something else because they already introduced that you can pull those tongues out and now it's like okay you can like the farther you pull your tongue out right the longer of a timer you'll have at the end so if i go all the way down here and i pull it out like all the way like that's a super super long timer now that i can go through it so i have that now and now i just have to rush over it's still not like the easiest thing in the world because i still have to like you know tight rope walk but like you know still oopsies i'm I, i'm gonna go back let me let me do the timer oh okay i'll wait till the timer's out there you go again that is so cool oh my god Use glitch? What do you mean by that? Okay. Uh, let me do up here. And do it again. Okay, nice. Alright, so we'll go across. Do this again. Uh, but not this this one. We'll, we'll go over here. Because we only need one tight rope. Uh, to, to function it. That. Okay, I can now climb on top, go over to the side, um, and then run this way. Oh, wait. I already have the key. Wait, shoot. Wait, wait, wait. How, wait, wait. I, I didn't even realize this. The wisdom gem. Okay, cool. Oh, oh, I went the wrong way. Wait, I'm not. I'm, I'm doing this kind of out of order right now. Wait, 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 wait. I, I, I'm actually doing it out of order. That's so funny. I'm not supposed to go this way yet. But I am supposed to hit that for later. Okay. Um, let's do this again. But this time, I have to go to the left and around. Um, with the tight ropes. There we go. Um, it'll go around here and then up. All right, so I can't go that way. But what I can do is this way. And then how do I... What's over this one? Oh, okay, okay. So I can actually just grapple to over here. Um, and that's how we start our journey. Okay, I think I got this. Uh, let's do the grappling hook again. Yeah, sorry that I'm uh, looking down all the time. It's just that I'm literally looking at the, the, the Wii U. So. Okay, let's try this. There we go. Okay, good. Good to know, good to know. All right, let's go over pro Hey, you know, I'm just I'm just letting the game have some extra time. You know, it's a speedrunner. I don't need that extra time. Um, it's all good. You know, we're no worries. Literally, totally fine here. Not I I, I I'm I like I literally don't don't even need the extra time there. So I'll chill. You see, uh, once again, don't need the extra time. But once again, uh, don't need the extra time. I'm still gonna make it. That was close. Oh, all right, we made it. <laughs> we made it. Uh, so that's the boss door. Uh, we'll let's get the boss key first. That is crazy. All right, second floor here. Do this, grab you, kill you. Oh, I can kill you with the grappling hook. All right, that was an excellent. I'll take it. All right, so uh, wow, this is a full. Wow, look at this. Look at this room. There's a full room here. Just to, just to get the boss key. Interesting. All right. Go across here. Um, and into a battle. Assuming with more ukes. 
Yeah, with more Ukes. Nice. Do you miss these types of dungeons in the Breath of the Wild? A little bit, yeah. Um, but I'm also, like, super happy that Breath of the Wild exists. Um, I think it's, like, kind of a different genre. If you're going to a Breath of the Wild, like, looking for, like, a Zelda game, you're not really going to find it. Um, but um, I think that's okay, you know? I think that's totally fine. Um, let's go over here. Nice, nice. Hit off pretty well. Don't hit me, keys. I need to kill the other one, too. Just in case. Nice. And there's, like, a skelly guy, you know? Uh, let's just keep following uh, where the game wants us to go. That's not where I wanted to go. NA aim. Okay, come on. Hey, I'm, 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 I'm only still, you know, bronze stuck in Valorant, but it's fine. I don't even have time to do it anymore. What am I supposed to do? Okay, this probably gives me a hint. What am I supposed to do here? What am I supposed to do? I, I, I let me let me figure this out. Okay. So there's two here. If I got on one in the middle like last time. I mean that. Oh. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. Okay, let me try this first. I think I might have a little solution to something. Oh, let me let me kill this skull guy first. <laughs> there it is, okay. Um yeah, wait, so that so there's nothing here that I need, so let me go off. I'll try it the other way first. Can you Yo, dude, what is that mechanic? Okay, that's cool. Dude, that's that. Tell me that's not cool. Tell me that's not cool. The grappling hook, you can grapple the other things. You can make a, a tightrope and you can slingshot yourself. All with one item. What? Okay, okay, okay. Uh, and then we do all these, I think, which opens up a chest, but we it doesn't open up the uh, ice yet. Yeah, so we need to figure a way to melt that ice. It's not going to be melting yet, but we'll get back to it. So we spawn the chest, just not the ice yet. Dude, that is so cool. Dude, they give this thing so many mechanics. They're like, hey, let's make three key items in one. Like, they really kind of went all out with this. Okay, so there's the chest that we need. Probably, presumably, with the boss key. Um, and then we have a second part of this, um, sort of, um, uh, over here. Uh, so we need to unlock the ice. Uh, we need to melt the ice somehow. Um, okay, so what's, what's here? There's something here. Yeah, that's what I thought. Okay. Maybe it's defeating all the enemies around here. Um, as like an extra thing. We'll have to see. Um, there's a Alright, 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 alright. We got we got some, some some funky mechanics here. Um Can I tightrope from one spot to another? I cannot. But I can do this. Does this propel me upwards? Oh, it does. It does propel me upwards. That's cool. So you can go up a level like that. Can I do this? I can. Can I jump on it? I cannot. Okay. Um, so you can't jump on to torches like that. But we're over here, which is awesome. We need to shoot this eye. Now, we're using all of our key items all at once. Zylocke's Brave, thanks for the 100 bits. I saw you playing Pokemon Reborn tomorrow. Yes. Um, I started playing it uh, last week, actually. I try to notify everybody of, like, my stream stuff. Um, sometimes, it's a good, sometimes it doesn't get to everybody. Um, but I've already played it last week. Um, so this will be a second stream of it. Okay, so 
that that's all right that's an easy like return back so then let's go here no. uh what zelda game is your favorite i like breath of the wild i think it's my favorite uh so far phantom hourglass with the mechanics honestly one of my more favorites oh okay this one's weird okay so looking away the eyes open so we need to figure out how to do this okay how do i hit the eyes if they're looking away um can i hit them with a bomb would that work no doesn't work that's not gonna work either um something to do with being up here oh on the side they don't see me right wait um okay maybe i need to be on a different end of the grappling hook okay so Can I shoot an arrow off of the grappling hook? Dude. What the heck is that? What is that? That is so cool. Cool mechanic? I right, got a small key for later. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh my god, dude. Dude, 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 dude. That is so good. I am like awestruck by how ingenious some of these solutions are to these puzzles. That is amazing. Yeah, they, they really, like, they were like, hey, you know, all the other items, classic bombs, whatever, you know, like, we get the boomerang. And then, like, let's go really hard on the grappling hook. Let's make sure this thing can do everything. I'm really trying to make this, like, a physics game, too, you know? Predecessor to Breath of the Wild? Mm -hmm. I really doubt about it, you know? Uh, I gotta run. I gotta run. That's fine. Nice. All right, got the uke. Uh, and then and now I just need uh, the keys. There we go. Nice. Turns out this is the Breath of the Wild prequel. Well, technically, in the timeline, apparently all of the games in Zelda eventually lead to Breath of the Wild. Like, it is it, like convergence in the timeline. Where it's not like one, one side or the other. It's like, it will eventually, no matter how long it takes, they will eventually get to Breath of the Wild. Hey, two one your big ones. Let's go. Yeah, it's like a unified timeline. That's kind of how like it, it's supposed to work. All right, so now we have this other spot. What is this? Okay. You tell me about that. Um. So let's let's start with that then. Thank you. <laughs> Don't want to face you. Uh, let me have this too. Okay. So what if I? Oh wait. Okay, we can get up here. Can we grapple from the top? Ah, and then we head up like that, and we grapple by heading up. Oh, that's cool. That's creative. A little smaller puzzle there, but I like it. I like it. It really makes you think in three dimensions um, with the grappling hook. Then we got an ice puzzle walking challenge. Please stop. I'm not great at these. There we go. And this should unlock the ice at the end. We did it. We did it! Dude, what a what what amazing mechanics here. That's so cool. That's so cool. KDP, thanks for the two years. Welcome back. Fun fact, Friends from Hourglass is the direct sequel to Spirit Tracks. It is the prequel to Spirit Tracks. It is the sequel to Wind Waker. So it goes Wind Waker, Phantom Hourglass, Spirit Tracks. As direct sequels to each other. So a little bit, a little bit of there, but yeah, it's really cool. And there we go. Uh, you found 
the boss key. It's a huge, heavy key. Tap close to yourself, tap far away to throw it. Let's go face this boss. Okay, cool. Weird Jacks pisses me off something fierce. I've been told that it's great. I, I've been told that it's amazing and better than Phantom Hourglass. I've also been told that it's like the worst thing ever and they should have never made it after Phantom Hourglass. So. Uh, step into the blue light to return. All right, that's what it is. Okay, here we go. Let's face the boss. What is this thing? Whoa! Hello? Gleok, two-headed dragon. Okay, how am I supposed to do this? Um, so what are what are we? Okay, fireball. Um, there's four pegs that we have. Do you send me a blue fireball? Um, and do you send me anything else? I can just red. So I do this. Oh, what? Oh, okay, that's. Okay, wait, wait. I gotta figure this out. Okay. So, red fireball. Does red fireball hit. I think. Okay, hear me out. Hear me out. Blue hits red, I think, because they're not compatible. So, what if I. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so you're gonna shoot. Red's gonna shoot next. So, I do this. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, I think I got it. I think I got it. Blue's gonna shoot next. So, I do this. No, red's gonna shoot. shoot, shoot. You see what I'm trying to do here? Okay. Right, I gotta. Blue's gonna shoot next. So I shoot like that, and it goes towards red. Oh, it hit red. Okay, so blue hits red, red hits blue. So I go here, because red's going next. So I do that, it bounces off towards blue. Ah, that's so cool. Okay, I love it, I love it, I love it. So blue's hitting next. So you do it like that, bounce off against red. Cool. Oh, that's such a cool mechanic. Whoa, what are you guys doing now? Uh, hello? Um, uh, protection! Or not. Oh, I have to get on, you have to get on top of it. Okay. Oh, okay. I see. Uh, so you have to get on top of these. And then, can I, oh, you can't do this. And Um, so red's next, so I do this. Oh, wait, wrong, wrong, wrong way. Oh, that was close. All right, blue's next, so I go up here. Shoot off to the side. Oh! The armor's off! Oh, I have two hearts left. All right, red's not gonna work. Red, yep. I have two hearts left. Okay, okay, so tsunami, so I gotta do this. And I gotta top, uh, step on top, okay. And then we want the icebergs to go on either right or left. So they go on uh, right, okay. They're gonna follow me like this. Okay. <laughs> That's so cool. You actually have to use the tightrope to avoid... Uh, the water and the uh, and the ice. That's so cool. I love that. Okay. Who's next? Oh, wait, 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 what are you guys doing now? Okay, you're both. Okay, that's fine. Oh, you took them away. Wait, 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 wait. If you took them away, what, what do I do? Wait, what, if you took them away, what, how do I? How do I? How do I attack you guys? Oh. I pull you. Oh no! I had to pull it to. Oh God! Oh, but I had the y oh I had the purple potion. Wait, I have to pull it towards the the pillar. Yeah, so like that. Nice. I forgot I had the the potion. 
try to hit me again, and then you hit me again, and then try again. Nice! Awesome, awesome, good so far, good so far. This is going really well. Okay, so I need to do this, I think. Yep. Call an ambulance, but not for me. Oh, whoopsies, whoopsies. I didn't mean that. Jump down there. That's cool. Okay. Come on, attack me! Do what you want! Okay. So you attach those two and then you hit you? Are you dead? <gasps> I got one! One's down! And we just got one more here. Oh no, oh no, I messed up, I messed up. Oh, okay, I got hit three times, that's fine. Okay, I, I also messed that up. Oh, please tell me, okay, why am I messing this up so badly? There we go, there we go. and to hit, and to kill. And we beat the boss. Let's go, dude. Hell yeah. That was that was a really, really cool boss. I love how they did that. Because you had to do a bunch of different like bouncing mechanics. And you had to like tightrope as well. They really made such good use of the grappling hook. This game is so good. I... More people need to see this. This is such a good Zelda game. I can't believe it's like this unknown. I feel like so many people have like forgotten about this game. Wow. You got more sand for the Phantom Hourglass. We got two more minutes added. All right, let's uh, open you up real quick. And you got me a new heart container. Let's go. So now we have 10, 11 hearts. That's four, eight, uh, plus three is 11. Yep. Oh, wait, let me. Yes. Just look at the arena. Wow, what, what good use. That's so cool. Here we go. So this is the room, I'm assuming, with the second pure metal, the Azure. It's one metal you need to make the sacred sword. Only a sword forged of the three pure metals has the power to defeat Bellum. And we got the pure metal you're looking for. You did it, Link. Things got pretty wild and wooly on this island, but it was all worth it. Yo, Barry, thanks for the tier two for 26 months. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Um, I appreciate that. Thanks so much, uh, uh, Barry. And thanks for being one of my moderators. You're so cool. You're so cool. Thank you, thank you. Can we get some uh, blankies for, for Barry? Alrighty. Looks like you got your hands on that Azri. Nice going, guy. Thanks, man. I'm a Roo. No, seriously, the real deal. So here's the story. There I was, sipping my stew. So this is the actual Roo. When all of a sudden, a crazy youth bagged me. Maybe it was, a, it was when you exposed the youth who was pretending to be me, but that barrier thing that kept me locked up dropped and I escaped. So thanks for that. Oh, cool. We got some uh, closure there. So the actual Aru, uh is all good to go. All uh, high and tidy. Whoopsies. I ate so many bombs in my stomach. Oh. Oh, oh, oh so you're alive. Wait, they're alive. I'm trying to swallow uh, you whole like that was really uncalled for. <laughs> oh, wait, so they're actually like kind of friendly? Uh, where's the other guys? Oh, hello. Oof, my head hurts. It's like my brain was being controlled by some evil force. Now that I'm back to normal, I feel pretty guilty. This is some sort of awkward, but sorry if I tried to eat you. Oh? So Bellum was behind them being all mean. Oh, that makes sense now. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Or well, not cool for them, but you know. All right, let's do this. Uh, oh. Let's do this real quick. All 
All right, so let's. There's there's like a mini puzzle over here. I want to do it because um, I saw two treasure chests, and while like one treasure chest is like awesome, I feel like two is like even better. So let's just like get that, you know. Um. Yeah. Oh, I fucked up. Oh, Chad, I fucked up. We gotta do it again. Classic, you know. Classic Vellum. Excited to see the Pokemon Reborn playthrough. Ah, I hope you uh, hope you enjoy. It's it's a lot of fun. Um. Sorry, I need to uh, text you, Chris, to put the uh, um, uh, reborn VOD onto the uh, onto the channel. All right, so we stand on top of this, right? No, oh, that's too high. Um, but we do. Can I do this? Ah, uh, ha ha! Let's go. All right, what do we get? Ah, oh, 20 rupees. Cool. And then what else do you have? Uh, another 20 rupees. All right, so we have 1,400 rupees. Dude, we're rich. My God. Holy shit. Can I get on top of here? I probably can. But what else is over here? Oh, another chest. This one's a little more secret, though. It's like it's like they dupe you with thinking there's one chest, but there's actually another. With 100 rupees. Oh, my God. We're rich. Jesus Christ, my guys. All right. Is there another? Over here? I saw the other chest. Don't worry. I just want to make sure that there's, like, not another. All right, there isn't. Um, but I could go over here. Oh my god, I'm such an idiot! Ignore it, chat. Ignore it. I swear. I'm so sorry. I've let you down. I'm just gonna run over and then do the rest of them. Uh, real quick. Um, there's that one chest over there, but I want to see on the other side. Because there's the one chest that we drop down here, but I can't get back up. So, I want to go over here and to the other side and see if there's, like, another thing that worth, like, picking up or whatever, you know? <laughs> you fell plus L plus ratio. Alright, well, we can get back up if we go there, but that's not worth it, is it? Um, what's over here? Anything special? Okay. Again. Why does that exist? I'm very confused. Uh, chat, am I missing something? Yeah. I'm, am, am I? Uh, no? I guess not. Okay. Well, let's go this way. That's just randomly there. Is it really? Okay. I guess it's for you to just like play around with. Uh, we'll go over this way. And then we will open this chest. Hey, and we got a power gem. Uh, store in the collection screen for now. That makes 10. Um, unless we like jump across like onto something. I don't know. Um, yeah. Huh. All right. Let's keep going. What those gems do? I have no idea so far. I have no idea. We'll figure it out. What's a fair price for a used copy of this game? I'm playing it on the Wii U. Um, and it's like, I think it was 60 bucks on the Wii U for virtual console. I'm playing it like this. Which is like a cursed way, but it works. All right, we got the Azarine. Let's talk to, uh, let's talk to the chief and tell him. Uh, what? Me? Nice of you to ask, but I'm fine. Oh, okay. Well, we don't have to tell them. All right, let's go. Uh, let's head out. We got two of the three pure metals. Uh, let's talk to Linebeck and head back to the uh, Ocean King. So you finally got the pure metal. Whoa! There's no time to celebrate. As if all of our troubles are over, I won't rest until we find those three pure metals. And we're off to sea. Aye, aye, Captain. Uh... 
$60 for a game over 10 years old? Yep. Oh, wait, 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 chat, chat, chat. We don't have to go all the way back. We can use the slate, right? Is that the one? And we can fast travel! Woo! Let's go! Glad I remember. And back to Perkay. Secondhand Flatulence, thanks for the one year of your Prime Gaming. Welcome back. Hey, chat, if you guys are enjoying the stream uh, and, I, and you feel sad about the seagull that we had just killed, uh, feel free to follow the stream. Uh, a little heart, press that you know button. We have, uh, we're have we getting close to 500,000 followers on Twitch, which is super cool. And uh, make sure you have your Prime available. If you do, um, then, well, see if you do. <laughs> and then uh, use it. Because every time you don't use it, your prime, uh, you are wasting wasting your your goddamn hard-earned money. Uh, I'm trying to give you some free, free ad, free viewing, free emotes with your Twitch Prime. Connect your Amazon Prime account, and uh, you can subscribe. Your prime, I demand. There you go. See, Morgo demands it. Oh, here we go. Uh, let's let's do this. Um, all right. Um, come on in. You've tripped in the shipyard. Okay, so uh, we do have uh, the salvage arm. We'll fix it. But then also, I want you to um, customize my ship. Uh, specifically, I believe we got a new chimney. Yeah, a golden chimney. Yo, that's pretty sick, dude. All right. That's pretty sick. My birthday was two days ago, chat. You all forgot to give me a present, so give Point Crow a prime. <laughs> that's like, dude, that's like extra guilting. Okay, so let's go back to the Temple of the Ocean King. I'm assuming this is where we should go. Um, let's go back to the Temple of the Ocean King. And uh, what is over here? Can I get this way? Can I get over there? What the fuck do you... Huh? Hmm. Um, yeah, we gotta go to the Temple of the Ocean King, I think, and get that final sea chart. Anime Burr, thanks for the three months. Welcome back to the Murder Gudgeon stream. Oh, wait, is it in here? This might be it. Chickens, man. I know, right? Goddamn chickens. What does that do? New spot, new spot, new spot. Hey, what's up, Zora? Nice. Nice. All right, I had, to, I had to focus. Kamikaze, thanks for the Prime for three months. Thank you so much for using your Twitch Prime. I appreciate it. And uh, I'm glad that you could use emotes. Like, uh, like for example, um, Pecro Evil. Ooh. Um, a cliffside uh, not so far from here as a hidden weak spot. Shine a bean parallel with the t line between... Shine a bean parallel with the line... Uh, between the temple and Mercay Tavern. Okay, so parallel with the temple and Mercay Tavern. The tavern's here. Okay, so what is this? Ooh, okay. Find a beam parallel with that. Like that. Like that? What? A cliffside not so far from here has a hidden weak spot. Shine a beam parallel with a line between the temple uh, and Mercade Tavern. I did. 
Uh, Jazzy Slayer, thanks for giving sub. Yo. Hey, a hundred rupees, dude. We're rich. And the sickle anchor ship part. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> All right, uh, you know we got we got a uh, you know we just need a hammer now and we're good to go. Um, else over here? I guess not. Maybe it's perfect. Maybe the game meant perp perpendicular. Dude, let's do it like this. We can actually go here now. And then do I bomb this? Does it say a weak cliffside? Okay, okay, we're getting somewhere. Oh, it's a cool puzzle. That's a really cool puzzle. And then up here. Dude, these puzzles are sick. Jazzy Slayer, thanks for the five months as well. Look at this, Pico Bounce. Hey, we love Pico Bounce here. Oh, and now we're on this island. Now we're on the island that uh um I wanted to be on. So what does this do? It's a backtrack. We can come back here. you my name is Friedel oh, it's like beetle but uh, like off-grid <laughs> I'm but a humble singer who travels the world with a guitar in hand in honor of our meeting how about a song just a little ditty about a whimsy it's called magic box a box full of magic put in parts our treasure after time look inside and see a surprise truly spectacular from one hand to another magical box indeed glorious exchange magical box find out what's inside yes indeed tis the truth about these magical boxes put in the ship parts and treasures you don't want You'll exchange them with other players that, uh, it's like, okay, okay, okay. So this is like online trading. Rest in peace, Nintendo Online. You will be missed. No matter what it is, the tag mode or battle mode, what could be in the magical box? If I not, give it a try. Right. Rest in peace, chat. We, oh, that's a treasure chest up there. Can't use it. The trade with other players. Cool. Hey, we got a wisdom gem. Cool, cool, cool. That's pretty neat. Rest and peace. <laughs> rest and peace. I hope you get both rest and peace. You know? Alright, I'm gonna... Um, real quick. Game looks so much like Wind Waker. It is the sequel to Wind Waker. Would you believe that? Yeah, it's kind of crazy. I get a lot of people who just don't know what this game is. I didn't know that at all. This is literally the direct sequel to Wind Waker. All right. Um, half a second. I'm going to go to the bathroom. Follow the stream if you haven't, and I will be back. Bam! Be back. I'll uh, give you like two minutes, three minutes.
Hello. I'm back. Let's go. All right, let's do Temple of the Ocean King. Let's get that uh, last uh, sea chart. You guys ready? You guys down with it? All right, let's go back in. So this is our halfway point. Yeah. Oh, wait, wait. Right, this is our halfway point. Return to the sixth floor using four minutes and 28 seconds. Damn it. Almost. We're eight seconds. Eight seconds less. So we gained two minutes. Does that mean we go back with 13 minutes and 32 seconds? Jesus. Okay. Nice. Um, all right. I guess let's, you guys, you guys ready for the temple of the ocean king? You ready? Oh Lord. Okay. Right. I forgot about this. I forgot about these. Um, okay. I forgot the solution. That's my other issue. Like, it's not just like I forget like how it goes. Like I literally, I legitimately forget the solution to this. Um, okay. Sunshine stand thanks for the three months. There has to be like a faster way. Okay. Right, and then we go across. Right, I forget about this. Um Wait, is this the one where they go across? Shit, I can't remember. Okay, I gotta focus on this. This is this is the uh, part where we like, I'm just like hoping and praying that like you know, because we have 13 minutes, not a lot of time. Can I go across here? And it is the one where I go across. Okay, nice. I gotta be patient though. I gotta be patient. Picro, uh, yeah, I, I I just gotta be patient. How do we? Thank you. Are you winning, son? I am. I am winning. How'd you go across? That's like a secret area uh, that the game kind of tells you about. Okay. Oh, wait, there's bomb chews. I didn't even realize we could just like bomb chew this. <gasps> oh! That's what that's used for. That explains it. That's that's that it makes it a lot easier then. Okay, 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 okay. So there's like some like small shortcuts in this that makes it like everyone's lives a little bit easier. All right, good so far, good so far. Want to know something funny? Your mom? I <laughs> got him. Oh shit. Um. Nice. Uh, you didn't drop your time. No, I'll take more time. Okay. How do I do this again? I think I have to, I forget exactly um, what we need to do here. Um, oh, 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 we have the square one immediately. Right. I remember this. Fuck. That's fine. That's fine. I got. I got to focus here. Charge that. Got to focus. Really focus hard. pinging to alert the phantoms yeah it's like loud like that's that's like a loud uh um um thing so like like this will alert you know i'll be like okay. 
That's fine with me. Right, so now we go over here. I gotta I also gotta kill these uh these Reaper guys so that I can uh take their time because they dropped 30 seconds, which is huge for us. Hey, what's this? Oh! Hey, wait, it just gives you the triangle crystal? Since when? What? Oh, oh, I need the triangle crystal, don't I? Wait, I gotta, I gotta... Right? I gotta go back? No. Wait. There we go. Was it Phantom Hourglass for Thursday? Um, it was, and then I didn't want to do it on Thursday. So I did it instead today. Um, okay. Right, because the circle one's right here, isn't it? It's like right... Wait, where's the circle one again? Wait, chat, where's the circle... Where's the circle one again? What Zelda game is this? This is Phantom Hourglass. It's in the it's in the title and everything. Oh, uh, it's kind of unknown. Uh, I think a lot of people have forgotten about this game. Um, and so we're playing it. So. Um, you're the one playing? Yeah, but I just forget where it was. Oh, was it? Chat, wasn't it like right over? Wasn't it right here? You remember that? get over there again oh i think i have to yeah okay i have to go over this way i think oh <gasps> wait can i can i grapple over oh my god let's go big brain dude all right round okay all right all right here we go Everything's fine. All right, that was a clutch move, dude. That was sick. All right, that was pretty good. That was pretty good. Um, and then now I need to go all the way back down. I need to go back up this way. We're going fast. We're going fast. Don't worry. We're speeding along. I'll, you know, I still got, uh, oh, what the, my camera died. What? Hello? Hi, that was weird. Plugged in. That's fine. Grab. All right, here we go. Let's go. Uh, oh, I haven't saved like in like ages, actually. Okay. We need to go this way. Throw this one over that way. It doesn't really matter. And we'll take the square. Awesome. That didn't take too much time. Uh, 
Oh, will we, am I able to make this? No. Oh, fuck! Everything's fine. We're all good. I still got. I still got twelve minutes and nine seconds. All right, what was the order again? It was uh, offer the three crystals and the pestles. What there was like a weird there was like a weird order it, 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 like does like more. I forget what it was. We'll have to go back in and, and see it. Did I just accidentally do it? Oh, yo, let's go. Did I, did I actually just... Oh, nice. Let's go, dude. Hell yeah. All right. Let's 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 see what, we, what damage we can do with this. If I can do up here, grapple you. Uh, up here. Can I grapple up here? I can't. Okay. Oh, so then I push this guy down. We gotta, we gotta wait. We gotta wait. This is the uh, Temple of the Ocean King, so there's a lot of, uh, a lot of stuff, a lot of issues. But uh, Alexis Potato, thanks for the 26 months. Welcome back to the murder. Glad you're on the stream. We're gonna play Spirit Tracks after we finish this game. I, I, I've said it once. I'll say it again. I'll play it if I, uh, if I end up liking all of Phantom Hourglass, and uh, if you guys like it as well. Nice! Let's go. All right, one phantom down. Oh, right, right. The one phantom down. I actually want to kill that other phantom as well. See if I can. Right. I don't think we can, though. Because the other phantom needs to, like, go down. Are you playing on 100%ing it? I don't really 100% games. Uh, it's not for me. I don't really like to. There's the key there. How do we get this key otherwise? It won't work. I don't know. If that didn't work, I'm gonna go back and do this again. Do you want Phantoms of Breath of the Wild too? That would be kind of cool. That'd be kind of sick. I wouldn't. I wouldn't be mad about that. All right. So we do this. We'll kill at least one of these guys. Nope. Get it. Okay. There it is. That's what unlocks it. That's what I wanted to see. And then we can kill this phantom now and then get the key. Awesome. There it is. Oh, and we got that too because we killed both phantoms. Nice. I love how they did bomb shoes in the game. I do too. All right, so Temple of the Ocean King. Woohoo! Let's go. All right, let me do that, and that opens the uh, the area up to us. Um, I can grab 15 seconds. Easy. Uh, bomb this. Okay. Um, you know what? Can I go across here? I can't. There is a bomb chew area there, but we'll go back. Okay, we'll go this way. Up through. And what's cool about this is that there's there's no phantoms to kill us. So even if they like do like alert us and everything, we're fine. Nice, that's one down. If we get all of them down, then uh, I think we get like a special prize. So I would like to do that <laughs> very much. Hey, 100 rupees. And that's down, so we go around. Hey, 
Okay, nice. Good, so far so good. Oh my god, this is so much fun. I can't, I can't like overstate how much fun I'm having just doing this. Okay. The puzzles are so entertaining. Nice, and that's all of them down. Ooh. You know what? How do we get up there? I want to get up there. Hello. A treasure chest there of all places. How is anyone supposed to get to it? Oh, I wonder how. Well, actually, no. There's there's a there's a digging spot right over here. And then and then there's. It's gonna take longer than the time it like actually takes for me to do this. Um. I like a oh. Dude, I need to get that chest. How do I do that? Do you like maybe I put like a bomb on here? How far in the game are you? Um I have no idea, but uh I wanna say like 80%. Maybe 90%. What is up here? How do I even get up here? Oh, wait, I think I know. Wait, 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 I think I know. I go across here, right? I jump up, and then I grapple to the chest for a red potion. Okay, <laughs> that was a little underwhelming, but sure, I'll take it. And then 30 seconds for our troubles um, that we got. All right, but I got it, I got it. So that's, that's good to know. Um, and then we can go all the way around. Hey, you know, Peggle's always the answer. Okay, cool. And now we can go one floor lower, see what's up with this one. What's over here? Oh, more of these guys. What's what's this way? Hello. Hi, phantoms. Goodbye, phantoms. I won't miss you. I will not miss you. you down all right what do you have to say here turn this switch on and it goes out right away if there's a way to make it uh time i would have been able to cross the bridge okay I'm assuming that's a bomb chew mechanic let's go down here wait what, what's, what's over here oh what the hell i don't know why but i've got this feeling i feel like there's a clue up ahead okay what the f okay. What is this? Feet and thing? Okay. What? I'm so confused. Okay, alright, alright. Well, I, I, I probably do this, right? And then do I like throw a bomb on here? It's like, like, is that weighted or something? So, I have no idea. Okay. okay, whatever. All right, let's keep going. And then down over here. Yeah, it went back. That's fine. Interesting. Stupid. Huh. I see a lot of deleted messages. Chat, stop spoiling. I don't wanna I wanna know. 
It's like it, it doesn't make it fun if I, if I uh, if the game gets spoiled for me. You know what I mean? It doesn't make it like a satisfying sort of uh, thing. Uh, conclusion. It's no fun being able to play using the control pad. If I have one regret, it's being stubborn and saying such a thing. I have no idea what that's supposed to mean. Because I've been playing with the stylus this entire time. <laughs> so I wish I knew, but I cannot relate. Hey, awesome. We got a chest for beating all the uh, things. What does this do? Okay. Is that also a timer? Is not a timer. That's meant to happen. Okay. Fuck. That's gonna disappear real quick. Oh shit! In the in the phantoms right there. Oh no 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 no! God. Hey, what's up, Yeprex? How's it going? figure out how did how the hell do we do this I need to get up so oh that's how we get up there it is there it is okay so this is that then I need to go this way what is this step on this floor uh, the four switches atop the four platforms okay so this is number one um, and then watch this I think I know how to do this right because we go down here and it follows down and then we go to here yeah 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 right and that's what we needed all right, I was like, when I saw that, I was like, I think that's the solution, but I don't want to make, you know, I don't want to, I think, I think we can. Double the four switches, top the four platforms. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So that's, that's two of them so far out of four. Okay, that's fine. Be a fairy, be directed by a Wii U stylus. Dreams, you know, don't let your dreams be dreams. You know how it goes. All right, so there's other, there's, uh, there's another um, two platforms up here, but how do we get on top of those? That's the next question. Um, oh, there's, there's my answer. Oh no. Okay, all right, I see my answer. Uh, there's another, there's another thing we got dig to do. Temple's the main reason people don't know about the game, by the way. Yeah, I think a lot of people, I think a lot of people don't like the Ocean, the uh, Temple of the Ocean King because there's like a lot of backtracking, you know, um, with it. But I think it's a lot of fun. Um, I think it's entertaining. But I can totally get it why people wouldn't like it, you know. Um, okay, this one's weird. Cause I have to like, you have to pull this. Oh no, you don't. No, you don't. I lied. Oh shit! 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 shit. Oh god! Oh god! No! 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 Where was the other switch? It was in the upper right corner. Oh, that's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Right here. Awesome. Okay. And what did we get? A uh, Helmarok, Helmarok plume. What is that? Helmarok plume. Treasure. That's cool though. A fancy feather. Ah. All right, we got eight minutes and fifty seconds. Dude, 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 dude. We we got the uh we got the phantoms patrolling here. Alright, what's like over this way? So while we're while we're observing, what's this way? Oh, I guess it's like a way to distract the guard. Bombs well, the time runs out, we start taking damage. Um, like, like, per second. It's, like, crazy. Basically, we die. Ruby, thanks for the 17 months. Got 
fine. I'll just get caught. I'll get caught because it's easier just going from here. Yeah, I think a lot of people didn't like the repeat dungeon with stealth mission kind of style. So. Okay. That's probably why a lot of people like kind of just like quit the game. But I find it a lot of fun. Around town? Oh, no, not around town. Not yet. Here we go. And then all the way up, and then we just do the other one right here. Ah, and there it is. We got it. Okay, so that was all four, I'm assuming, right? Yeah, we did. Yep, yeah, here we go. All right, so we got all four. We have eight minutes and 25 seconds left, and now we're on to a, uh, a lower level here. Okay, uh, we got more time. this opens it up uh, let's take our crusty boomerang for the eye oh i thought i got you oh wait wait whoa, whoa, whoa. do this oh <gasps> yo wait that was actually super helpful wait he can teleport to you anywhere Oh, that was so Giga Brain unintentionally. It's always worth killing these guys because they give you treasure. It, it seems like, at least. Okay. So we got like a Triforce thing. I'm assuming we have to go somewhere with it. Like we have to put it somewhere. Yeah, so we just go up here, and there's three of them. Okay, I only have one from the, the phantom that I got. Well, I'll put it here, yeah. Camera turned off again? What the fuck's happening? What's going on? Is it overheating? plugged in. I don't know. Okay, hello guys. I'm back. <laughs> Sorry about that. Okay, here we go. Wait, there's a... Oh, when did you appear? One of these guys? I want the time, guys. Yeah, there we go. You give me 30 seconds. I'll take that. Hello. Alright, so what did you want? Uh, there were only a few phantoms, so I let my guard down. I should have prepared a safe place from the beginning. Okay. Interesting. Hey, a force gem. Okay. <laughs> oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, come on. No. Oh, wait, wait, whoa, 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 Oh, how are we supposed to do this? Okay, well, we still got it. Okay, we still got the second one. Okay. I got the second one. 
First try of new epic. Hell yeah, welcome in. All right, so now we got to go around and the other side. All right, we have eight minutes left. It kind of looks like the Triforce. No. No way. That's crazy. Nice. Got the extra time. Oh, no, 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 no. Got the extra... Okay, okay. We're in the safe zone, though. We're in the safe zone. Okay. Nice, 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 nice. That was a close one. That was close. That was close. Dude, dude, I'm like... I'm like... Monka Wing like all the time during this game. All right, fill all the eyes, and we got. Oh, let's go back there for the chest. Thanks. I'm assuming we're only need to put it like there. All right, another force gem. A oh, dude. I got past them. What does this do? Oh, let me go back now. Okay. Okay. Nice. Uh, so I'm actually going to go back here. Uh, and get that little chest uh, that we have. Uh, that we unlocked. Yeah, so what's here? A, a tall chimney ship part. <laughs> nah. We got a tall chimney. Let's go, dude. Hell yeah. You know me. Always love those tall chimneys. All right. And now we got the last one right here. Awesome. And that opens up the door to what I assume is the the next sea treasure. Yes, yeah, so is this sorry, it, it, this opens up the door to what I assume is the next map? No, we have another floor. Okay. I don't know why I did that. That was probably stupid. That was probably really stupid. Let me go back up. I, I, you know what? You know what? I'm going to hard read this. I'm going to hard read this. And we'll come back down. And we'll see this thing. I'm going to throw it in the middle of the pit. Okay. The path will open when you possess the ability to... to, to when you possess the ability to, to defeat a phantom. Well, I can't yet, so... What is this? The Northeastern Sea Chart! Okay, nice. New area unlocked. Now you can explore a new area of the sea. We did it, Link. This is the last chart. It's the northeastern corner. Now you can travel all the corners of the high seas. Let's go back to the ship. We got new waters to explore. Okay, okay, okay. Is there like a... Do I not get a... <laughs> Do I not get a... um Like a... Like a check checkpoint or anything? Can I have a checkpoint. What a big door! How do we open it? Okay. <laughs> okay, I guess not. I I would like a checkpoint. <laughs> All right. Well, let's go to the northeastern sea.
and <laughs> see what's up. Oh my god. He has those in the book. He's crazy. Come on, come on, that was a good one, right? That was good? No, no, you didn't like that. All right, um, well, today's going to be a little bit of a shorter stream. Um, I said uh, until I get tired. I got a little bit tired. I, I was uh, uh, out late last night and everything, so. Um, yeah, uh, chat, if you guys uh, liked today's stream, I know it was only four hours, uh, but tomorrow I will be streaming uh, Pokemon Reborn, uh, followed by, on Tuesday, Pokemon Heart, Gold, Soul, Silver, but every battle my team is different. Uh, followed by Wednesday, which is Breath of the Wild multiplayer, speedrunner versus hunter. I try to beat the game while Trey tries to kill me. And then on Thursday, I'm going to be doing Birio Kart with Ludwig.